everyone. I am putting up a video today because I'm excited of something I found when I went to the drugstore this afternoon. So, we have a new drugstore in town. We've got a crank over the bed. Uh, here, probably not. Not a bit. Ah, Rexall. Rexall. I scrunched because I scrunched it up. Rexall. So, uh,. I don't know how new they are. They definitely in our town. I've heard them before, but I've never seen one or been in one. And they had some good sales on, so I decided to try it out. And when I was there, um, looking for I was a snack, I was looking for sunflower seeds. And I found something that made me super excited. Bam! Combos. Combos in Canada. That's right. Uh, we used to have combos. I know I've had them before, but it's been a lot of years. And I do remember loving the pizza ones, which unfortunately I couldn't find. I did find the cheddar cheese pretzel flavored filling made with real cheese. Sure, I agree with that. that. Um, I got two bags. I got the cheddar pretzel and the other kind they had was the seven layer dip tortilla with natural and artificial flavors. So... But no real cheese in these ones, thankfully, because who would want to ruin real cheese? Anyway, so they were $2.99 plus tax, which is a lot for a snack item, which is, let's see there, let's see, 178 grams, 6 ounces. Pretty sure these are from the States, because they have the obligatory... We have to put it in French, so we'll put a sticker over things, sticker on it. So those ingredients are in French, the English are actually on the bag, which it's not focusing. Oh, goof. Does it want to focus? And I think I'm too close. Well, I'll just read them. There's wheat flour, vegetable oil, palm kernel oil, whey. Oh, there's cheese blend of bakers and cheddar cheese. Parmesan Romano, so... Apparently there's real cheese in it. <clears throat> so, cheddar cheese. I uh, will be honest, don't like cheddar cheese. I'm not a huge cheese lover to begin with, and then when it comes to cheeses, cheddar is the one I hate the most. <laughs> um, I will eat it, I will be honest, and I will definitely not put my opinions against it. My first video. Right. So, so you can see there are little pretzel bits in there. And they smell like, for most of you know if I said to you, Kraft Parmesan cheese in a plastic cup you buy for like spaghetti. That's pretty much what the inside of the bag smells like. Which isn't offensive, it just smells like feet. This is a combo. It's got the pretzel and salt. Hole in the middle. It's empty. Maybe I'll find one that's actually got filling in it. <laughs> that's funny. Oh, we have cheese. So you can't see it because it's the same color as a pretzel. You can see it better on that side. And it's a pretzel, so I'll take a bite. I'm gonna drink half of it. I was breaking apart in my hand. Mm. For the most part, it tastes like pretzel. Um, there is some. Um, it's really bright. Slight hint of cheesiness. I think I'm gonna. It's too bright. You can see the cheese better now. The lovely orange cheese. Starting to bring crumbs everywhere. Where's the rest of it? Excuse my crunching. Mmm. <clears throat> mm. No. Definitely has a cheese flavor. Cheddary cheese. Like I said, I got cheddar cheese spread. That's a good one. Kind of 
not as bad as Cheese Whiz or processed cheese. Definitely has more of a real cheese flavor, which is nice. If you, if you like cheese, personally, I'm not a big fan, but it doesn't, uh, doesn't taste too fake. It tastes cheesy. It's not real cheesy. I don't. All right. <clears throat> I'll wash that down because it's pretty dry. They're dry, but they are pretty tasty. And if I like cheddar cheese, those would be definitely go to. They're a little salty, but not overly salty. I don't know. Probably get a few in you. That'd be a bit too much, but <coughs> definitely tasty. So the other one I bought was the seven layer dip with a tortilla outside, not a pretzel. And I believe these are the same amount. Yeah. And king fries. So, you can see, they smell pretty good, but they're not huge bags anyway, so, so they are lighter colored, not, they definitely feel the salt on it, but you can't see it as well as on the other one, and the filling has some, it's kind of light brown in color, beigey, so this do resemble beans, even though it's seven layered up. Mm. Oh, that's weird. Oh, oh my gosh, it tastes like seven day layer. That is the weirdest thing ever. Definitely, it tastes like refried beans, guacamole, salsa. Wow, that's surprisingly good. Holy crow. Wow, it tastes like seven layer. Yep, that's the weirdest thing ever. I mean, you expect it to taste like clothes, but not, not like you actually just dipped your chip in the seven layer dip. Wow, that's good. Definitely less salty. A little bit of kick to it. Not super spicy, but more spices. The middle texture is a little off-putting. It's kind of dusty, but if you get it all together, it's not too bad. Those are a definite buy. Again, if you like seven layer dip, this is the weirdest thing. It tastes like I just ate refried beans and guacamole. <laughs> it's good. Really good. So combos in Canada, people. If you're interested, yeah. At Rexall. Probably other places, but definitely Rexall. Saves you a trip. And they're delicious. Mm. Alright, everyone. Thanks. Bye.